Set him up. How much was that? Damn! That was a thousand yen. Hey guys, I'm Kina47 aka Wolfkin, and welcome back to Shenmue. So I spent about two hours of in-game time just practicing the fighting mechanics in the game. It does take some getting used to, but it does remind me a lot about Virtual Fighter, so... I am getting to grips on things, I just have to actually get into an actual fight to apply what I've learned. But I did learn a few moves, I did learn how to hand how some of the combos are handled and how some of the moves are handled. It's around, it's about to be 6 and there are some bars open, so... I'm probably gonna start heading into some of these bars to see if I can ask if the if sailors hang around and take it from there. Hopefully, hopefully I get some information. Excuse me. Oh. Oh, hey, Rio. I can't serve you alcohol, but uh, have a seat. Thanks. How about a cola? Sure. Well, at least he's cool enough to give me something to drink. You never say no to soda or water. So, what's up? I still hear the drinking sound effect. Saijo-san, do you know any places where sailors like to hang out around here? You say sailors, but you don't mean just any sailor, do you? Right. Try the MJQ Jazz Bar or Heartbeats Bar. Is that where they go? But you best be careful. I hear they run with a dangerous crowd. Any guys with tattoos on their arms? You'll probably find guys like that there. That's alright. I'm still hearing the drink sound effect. Oh god. Did they fuck up the sound here? Please tell me it's gone when I get out. Good, it is. So I need to go to the bars that sailors frequent. MJQ Jazz Bar and Heartbeats Bar. So, I remember what the jazz bar was. I think it was over here. No, I'm wrong. That's bar Linda. Heartbeats bar. Okay, where was the MJQ jazz bar? I'm an idiot. I just went to it the previous episode, and I can't remember where it is. Oh, I'm dumb. It's on the other side. Ah! Uh! This is just a sign that I don't know this town. It kind of reminds me of Yakuza, where... I have to learn the town. There it is, the jazz bar. But it's closed right now. It opens at 1900, so that's 7 o'clock. That opens at 7, but what about the Heartbeats bar? I've never seen that one. Where? Um, I have no clue where the Heartbeats bar is. Um. What is it, kid? Oh, sorry. I need to ask you something. Forget it! Um. Who the hell do you think you're talking to? You fucking with me? What the f I've got a question for you. I got nothing to say. I will hurt you. This guy is something else. What about you? Can I talk to you? Oh, no, son. Oh, it's you, Ryo. I heard you had a hard time. Yeah. Are you okay now? Yes. I feel a lot better now. Don't overdo it. Oh, that's all he had to say. Of course. Wait. What's down here? Ain't got time for punk kids. Get out of here. S sorry, motherfucker. Jesus. Rude. Alright, so I don't know where a bar heart called Heartbeats is. But I know what a jazz bar is, so I have to wait for that to open before I can uh, maybe get some info. So, I guess I gotta kill time for a little bit longer. Actually, let's go in here for a little bit. I wanna see what's in the store. Oh, god damn, these controls. These controls are gonna be the death of me, I swear to god. Let's see. These are tapes. Low girl, Linda, go go. C sized batteries, A sized batteries, a flashlight. Hmm. There's more milk. I got dried fish. I don't want to buy milk for the cat, thankfully. God damn it. Actually, what's... What's that? It's not letting me do anything with it, so I'm guessing it's nothing. Minako-san. What? 
Do you know anywhere that sailors have? I'm not. Out? Uh, I already know. Boys come here sometimes, but I don't know if they're sailors. I see. Oh well, that didn't help at all. But whatever. I just want to look in here real quick. So there's a flashlight. There's bat. I have a feeling I'm gonna need those items later, but I'll wait. I don't know. Part of me feels like I should buy them now, but I guess I'm just being that guy. I wanna save up the money that I'm currently getting, which is only 500 yen. Oh yeah, we haven't seen this cutscene. Look at the Sega logo in the background. <laughs> Alright, it's night. So, let's go to the jazz bar now to see if any sailors are there. Yes, open the door with both hands. MJQ. Oh, they're playing pool. Wait. Damn it. Wait. Um, yeah? What? Are those people sailors? Who knows? Why don't you ask them yourself? But don't start anything. Got it? Okay. Alright, I'm not. Yeah, I remember talking with these people the other video. Got a minute? Hey! The kid's saying something! Are you guys sailors? Mm, could be. Hey kid, how about a game? Huh? Game? You sink the ball in one shot, you win. And I'll answer your questions. But you miss, I win. Buy me a bourbon, okay? All right, let's go. You're on, just have to make the shot, right? Try your luck. Let's hope the controls aren't too bad. If they actually make you play pool. Alright. Oh, that's actually a pretty hard shot. Um. Um. What am I supposed to do? Oh, from the overhead view, access your position and consider how to aim. Press X to switch to close up and use the L stick to fine tune your aim. Press circle to return to the previous view. Press X to shoot to. Okay, so. Wait. Press X to shoot the cue ball. Oh, I see. Okay, so. I gotta figure out a way to hit this so it goes in. Um. It's hard to tell, honestly. I think I'm gonna go for here. Go for it. Ah, I was off! I was off by a lot. Damn it. Missed. <laughs> Thanks, kid. Darn it. Set him up. How much was that? Damn! That was a thousand yen. Okay, I'm not risking that. I am not risking that again because that was a lot of money that I just lost. Fuck. The only other place I could think of is down here, which I haven't been, I haven't checked yet. Oh, there goes a the cutscene. All right, I'm in the right place. I have to be. Get out of my way. Oh boy. What? Go home. Oh! Okay, you. Ooh. He just flipped them into the fucking containers. Up. Uh, yep, this has to be it. Heartbeats. Oh my god, though. That I'm angry that I that I messed that shot up. Damn, that's a thousand yen I just lost in that too. Fuck. Welcome. There you go! Milk's perfect for a schoolboy, I'd say! <laughs> of course, it being that kind of person. Are those guys sailors? Maybe. I'm looking for sailors who work with Chinese ships. What are you, some kind of TV detective or something? Back off! Whoa! You little punk! Rio, that- You remember some of this? I fucking hell. That was quick, though. Whoop! Rip that guy! You stupid! Oh! 
Rip him too. Oh. <laughs> That's enough. You put on quite a show, boy. I'm looking for info about it. I'm pretty Chinese sure I fucked that up, but they gave me a, 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 a recovery. What? In return, you don't show your face here again. Okay. Look for a guy named Charlie. Charlie? He deals in smuggled goods. He's well known in the underworld. He should know about the Chinese cartel. Where is he? He loves his hog. Try asking at the motorcycle shop nearby. Okay. What's he look like? He always wears shades and a black leather jacket. And he's got a tattoo on his arm. A tattoo on his arm? Enough talk. Now get out. All right. I did not expect that quick time event to like have like multiple buttons. So I did screw up one of them, but it looks like they gave me a chance to recover at the very. See, at least these some of these quick time events are being forgiving. I can at least give this game that is that some of these events are being forgiving. Also, since I'm right here at the motorcycle shop, I get next to this guy. Hey, Rio. Do you know a guy named Charlie? Charlie? You know him? He's such a poser. Thinks riding a hog makes him look cool, but it don't. He ain't a real biker. Huh. Do you know where he lives? No idea. He only stops by sometimes. Oh yeah, go to Tsuruoka's place. You mean Tsuruoka-san at the jacket shop? I heard Charlie goes there sometimes. Thank you. The jacket shop. That's closed right now, so... Honestly, I'm not gonna get any information for the rest of the night, because all the shops are closed. I guess that is one of the problems with Shenmue is that you have to get used to the idea of having to stop what you're doing for the day so you can uh, pass time and then like go back and get back and get back to work on things. Oh wait, he's here! He's here! Isn't this it? No, that's military su surplus, you dummy. This is the jacket shop. Yep. I'm an absolute dingus. Whatever. I'm gonna head back home. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just go back home for today. It's about to be, it's only like nine, but you know what? Better to get it done now, so that way I can keep going with the video, than just dick about with nothing to do for the rest of the night. So I'm just gonna make my way back. Still, that was horrible. That I fucked up at pool and I lost a thousand yen. That was horrible. And I'm still gonna buy some capsules. Toy capsules. I don't care. A hundred yen each, huh? Yeah, let's buy some virtual fighter ones. Maybe just one. Yeah, I'm only buying one because I just lost a lot of money from that fuck up. All right, what do I get? I got this is cool. I don't remember who that is, but pretty sure they're gonna tell me. Wolf, right? I'm a dummy. Maybe I should get another. Nah, no more, no more. Changed my mind. Yeah, let's save our money because we lost a bit. But, yeah, like, I remember Wolf from Virtual Fighter. That's what I mean. I used to play Virtual Fighter when I was younger, back when it was a big thing. In fact, I got into the series thanks to my mom's friend. I know, weird kind of history lesson and such. So, you know. Anyways, let's head back home for today. So, I guess there's not much else I need to do for today. I'll head to um, the jacket shop tomorrow. To see if we can get more information on this guy Charlie. And it's only 9 p.m., so hey, I got back home at a decent time this time, Ine-san. Like, this would be my curfew if I was his age. Like, I'm pretty sure my parents would want me back at around this time anyway, so. Um, okay, the gamma doesn't look too bad, thankfully. Alright, let me um Okay, um, training. Throw moves. Wish to train specific moves? No. Train throw move. Train throw moves only. Um, this was the save I did before. I'll wait to save after I'm done. Settings, I'm fine. Let's just go to sleep. Ask. I can't pronounce that. I'm an idiot. Anyways, it's now um, the next day, so let's get ourselves ready. 
Um, is there anyone else around? Looks like Yuni-san's not here today. So, uh, well, it's, she's not here right now. I have checked this place already. I know that for a fact. Like, I've gone all... I've already searched this entire house, so... I think I could just go. Wait, what's this? Oh, it's the fifth. Right, it just says the fifth. Alright, that's cool. I like that detail. I have to be sure not to waste this. I literally just realized I went right back to where I started in terms of money. Um, again, I'm gonna walk. I'm gonna walk there because I do want to feed the cat. I do want to feed the cat again. That means I'm gonna have to buy some milk or something at the uh, convenience store for the next day for the cat. Hi, hi, cat. There's a cat here. We should get pet it. Why is there no pet option for cats? So, you know what? I'm not even going to go there. I'm just going to keep my mouth shut. Alright, where's that cat? Cat! Oh, hey, Megumi's here. Hi, Megumi. Hi, Adele. Do, do you think the kitty going to get all better? I'm sure she's going to be fine. I mean, we're giving it milk and food. Have you named her yet? Not yet. Dude, do you have any ideas? Let me see. Chibi, Mimi, Sasuke, Tama. Uh, I, the problem is I don't know the gender, but you know what? Mimi's not a bad name. How about Mimi? Oh, I get it. Because her ears are so cute. Uh-huh. Mimi. Alright. Oh, I didn't mean to press that. Shit. Get back. Let's call. How are you doing? <laughs> hey, see you soon. I'm gonna pet the cat now. You're still so tiny. Alright. Let's give it some food before... Oh, damn it. Wrong button. I gotta get used to these controls. Let's give it some food. I still have dried fish, so... Here you go, cat. You hungry? Here. Will it eat that? Yay! She's eating! She must have been very hungry. Yeah, and she looks real happy. Thank you, Dill. Wait. Wow, you have dried fish to last you a while, so... I may not have to worry about feeding her for at least a couple of days. And it's raining. Great. Alright, so... Let's make our way back to Dubuita so we can talk with this guy at the jacket shop. Hopefully he could tell us where Charlie is. Oh great, if it's raining, that means there's not gonna be Well, there probably won't be that many people outside. Because again, it's raining. Why would you want to be outside in the rain? Unless you're like me who's a complete weirdo and likes being in the rain. Alright, so This way I go. Yeah, I'm sorry I'm not talking much. It's just that there really isn't too much to say in this kind of... Oh, why am I doing that? Not too much to say in this kind of a game. It's like information gathering and such. And I kind of like that, honestly. Wait. Is that the jacket shop? Don't tell me. It's closed today? Please tell me it's not closed today. Because if it is, then that means I can't do anything today. Oh, that would suck. Uh, I guess I'm gonna go kill time. Oh, this opens at 10. Okay, I'm guessing most of the stores... You know what? I just realized the time. It's only 9.30. Most stores in any kind of area won't open till about 10. Even I can attest to this because most of the stores in New York stay closed until about 10 o'clock. And even then, some stores don't open until clear into 10.15 or 10.20. Like some, not all stores, but you get what I'm trying to say. It's like, if the store, if the store, oh yeah, there it is, there it is, now it's open, see? I knew it, it had to be 10. I'm a fucking moron. Excuse me. Hey. I'm looking for a guy named Charlie. Charlie? What's he like? He always wears a black leather jacket and sunglasses. Has a tattoo on his arm. Ah. You know him? There's this guy who's always whining about our jackets. Like he knows what he's talking about. 
Oh, he's showing off his tattoo. I see. Okay. About that guy with the tattoo? Yeah, he came by four or five days ago. Ugly as the worst sin. Oh, he's showing off his tattoo. What a loser. Know where I can find him? Nah, I wouldn't know and don't care. Sorry, I can't be of more help. I see. Crap. That puts me at a dead end. That puts me at a very bad dead end. Let me ask you to see if you know anything. Kurita-san. Yo, how are ya? Do you know a man named Charlie? Huh? Charlie? Wears a black leather jacket, sunglasses, and has a tattoo on his arm. I see that guy out in front of the shop sometimes. Always ragging my merchandise like he'd ever buy anything. Huh. huh. When does this Charlie come around? He usually heads over this way after hitting the jacket shop. You know, man, guys like that almost always look around without buying anything. I see. That doesn't tell me much, though. It just tells me that he does come around the area, but it doesn't tell me where he is or where he could possibly be. Ugh, this isn't helping. Sorry. You know what, let me ask Tom here. He hangs around this area. Tom. Hi, Dio. I'm looking for a guy named Charlie. Do you know him? Charlie? He wears sunglasses, a black leather jacket, and has a tattoo on his arm. No, I don't know him, man. Really? Where else could he hang out? Like, he goes to a jacket shop and otherwise, but where else could he go? Do I dare want to ask people at a thrift store? Excuse I doubt me. he would go to a thrift store. Hello? What can I do for you? Fuck. I'm looking for a guy named Charlie. What's he like? He wears sunglasses, a black leather jacket, and has a tattoo also. Uh-uh. I don't know him. I see. Oh boy, I'm in trouble. I have no leads on where this guy could possibly be. Um, wasn't there a patch and embroiled shop somewhere? Um, let me check over there. Why not? The only other place I can maybe think of is... Which, I don't even know if it's even it, if there even is one around here. You know what, let me ask the burger place, because this seems to be a central um, spot for many people. Hi, what can I get for you? Do you know a guy named Charlie? Charlie? What's he look like? He wears sunglasses and a leather jacket, and he's got a tattoo on his arm. Hmm, I don't think so. I see. God damn it. I have no idea what I'm doing right now. I'm just so lost. Fortune teller... That is the China shop. That's another thrift store. I don't know why I would go there. What's going on with this guy? Hmm. Hi. How's it going? What's wrong? I'm so thirsty. I want a drink, but I don't have any change. Yeah, I'll buy you one. Why not? I'll buy you one. What do you want? You're really nice. Thanks. What kind of drink do you recommend? Hmm. Let's see. Let's see here. We got orange, grape, jet soda, jet cola. We got coffee. Ugh. I don't know how that canned coffee stuff tastes. Let's do the cola. Can't go wrong with cola. Though, I personally more enjoy orange soda than I do hmm. cola. Here. Freeloader? <laughs> what a made trophy. My day. What a trophy name. Is the restaurant busy? Ah, uh, a little. You should come by again. And try Tao San special. Yes. Please give my regards to Tao San. Sure thing. I'll say hi for you. Okay, so this was just like a bit of an event. Like, just something that you can have some fun with. Okay, I've got to go. Got things to do. Okay, see you. Thanks again. Alright. Didn't get anything in terms of information, but you know what? I don't mind. I don't always have to do stuff like that, so... Where else could I find this guy? That's the problem. I have no idea where else I could look. See, like, this leads me back into... Oh, this is the main road back to Sakakugawa. 
So where else could I look for Charlie? Like I'm honestly confused. I'm honestly unsure about where else to go. It's like I'm just gonna have to ask around. Every do I really want to go to the fortune teller? Uh, let's do it. You know what? What's the worst that can happen? Quite honestly. Welcome, lost one. I'm curious. Excuse me? You seem troubled. I am. Shall I read your fortune then? It's 300 yen per reading. Eh, fuck it. Yes, please. Well, what type of reading would you like? Future, clue, gambling. Wait, clue? Let me see this. Please tell me a clue. <laughs> Please well. tell me a clue! Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. I can see it Please now. Please tell me a clue. A person seeks you on the road at night. Wait, a person seeks you at the road at night? I see. What is that supposed to mean? That I have to wait till nighttime to meet this guy, Shall Charlie? I do another reading for you? Um, sorry about that, guys. It seems like the recording messed up at one point, so... I'm pretty sure you'll still get the fortune-telling stuff, but... At one point, my recording did, in fact, fuck up, unfortunately. Wait a minute. Hi. Hey, it's you. Got a minute? Some other time, okay? I see. Eh, that didn't help. But anyways, um, the only thing I got was... The one you seek can be found on the night streets. So literally all that's telling me is the only the, probably I'm going to have to wait till nighttime to find the person I'm looking for because yeah it seems like more and more I'm not going to find I'm not going to find who I'm I'm looking for until then unfortunately But I guess while we kill a little time I might as well look around Um wait those are scrolls Rising Flash, Mud Spider, Crawl Cyclone, Arm Break Free. Wait, Arm Break Free? Twin Swallow Leap, Crawl Cyclone, Mud Spider. Let me grab Rising Flash, it's cheap. It's only 500 yen, so you know what? I'll grab this. Yeah, why not? That way we can learn a new move and. Can I have this? Yes! Thank you very much. This is the Scroll of Secrets. My grandfather said read this in practice and you'll become stronger. Alright, cool. Rising Flash. So let me read what that is. Um, collection, scrolls. Judging from the pictures, it's a hand move. Hand move, Rising Flash has been mastered. Okay, what is that exactly? Rising flash. Whoa! Forward, back, back, square. A blow to the opponent's chin, thrust by lowering the body and springing. Jesus, this feels like a virtual fighter kind of shit. Like, seriously, that's some virtual fighter shit. Oh. Okay, so I can mess that. I could probably come back here when I get more money. Like, when I get more money, I'll buy some more scrolls and buy some more, uh, moves. So, yeah, it looks like I won't be able to do anything else until the night. Oh, that sucks. Let me ask around a little bit more to Shinkichi see if I'm san. really sure. Hey, uh, Ryo. I'm looking for a guy named Charlie. Charlie? Who's he? He always wears a black leather jacket and sunglasses. And I hear he's got a tattoo on his arm. Oh, you mean... Wait. You know him? Nah, I just hear rumors. Word is he's a pretty nasty piece of work. Not the type you want to get involved with. I see. That doesn't tell me much. Oh, wait a minute. There is one other place I can always go to. The barber. I know that may not be, like, the best idea in the world, but then again, everyone's got to get their hair cut eventually. So, let's go to the barber and see if he can tell me anything. But, yeah, like I said, the only kind of clue that I got is that I have to wait till night. And if I have to wait till night, I have to kill a lot of time. So. Excuse me. Hi. Maida-san. Yeah? What is it? I'm looking for a guy named Charlie. Charlie? Never heard of him. What's he like? He wears sunglasses and a black leather jacket. I hear he also rides a motorcycle. A motorcycle? 
Then why don't you ask Ono-san at the motorcycle shop? Ono-san? I'll ask him. Thank you. I did ask him already, unfortunately, and it led to a dead end. Because he told me to go to the jacket shop, and then this guy told me at the jacket shop that he knows nothing. Like, I can go back real quick to the jacket shop, sorry. And I'm pretty sure he'll just tell me the same thing. Excuse me? Hey! I'm looking for a yeah, guy like, I'm named pretty sure Charlie. It's be the same thing. Charlie? What's he like? He always wears a black leather jacket and sunglasses. Has a tattoo on his arm. Ah, you know him? There's this guy who's always whining about our jackets. Right, it's the like same he dialogue. Knows what he's talking about. Oh, he's showing off his tattoo. I see. About that guy with the tattoo? Yeah, he came by four or five days ago. Ugly as the worst sin. Oh, he's showing off yeah, his tattoo. Yeah, it's the same dialogue. What a loser. Know where I can find him? Nah, I wouldn't know and don't care. Sorry, I can't be of more help. I see. Uh, so I'm gonna have to wait till nighttime. Apparently, I'm gonna have to wait till nighttime to talk with this guy. So that means I'm gonna have to kill some more time. Actually, this is an embroidery shot, isn't it? Yeah, let me ask him. Etoy son. Yes. Do you know a man named Charlie? A Charlie. Charlie. I know Charlie Chapman. Oh. But he's no longer with us. I assume you mean someone local. Yes, someone alive and from around here. He has a tattoo. Hmm, I have no idea. I see. The only other thing I could maybe think of is if there's a tattoo parlor here, but I don't know if there's a tattoo parlor here. Oh, uh, so I'm gonna have to wait till night again. Fuck. It make you do so much waiting. I guess that is one of the negatives that people have towards this game is that they make you do a lot of waiting for very little reason. Well, okay, there is a reason. It's because you have to adhere to a schedule and shit. So, I think in the meantime, I'm going to practice some moves while I kill time. So, but then again, I'm probably going to take a break here. I'm probably going to take a break here and, like, take a break from the session. So, anyways, guys, till next time, I'm Keen 47 aka Wolf Keen. Next time I start, it'll be nighttime. And hopefully, we can find this guy, Charlie. Till next time, guys, take care.